Welcome to Eking Out with Melly Mel. I'm Melissa. I am so excited for today's video because today I have a witchy video for you guys. Today I will be opening my very first box from Wolf and Time. This is their July 2022 box and the theme is The Wild Embrace. Keep watching. Alrighty guys, so like I said in the intro, today we are opening my very first box by Wolf and Time. This is their July 2022 box themed to the Wild Embrace. At the end of this video, I'll let you know what the theme is going to be for August. Now, um, just to let you guys know, I decided to try out Wolf and Time. I'll be getting their July and their August box. I just wanted to try something new. I ended up suspending my Goddess Provision subscription for the time being. Uh, first, just to kind of try other subscriptions like this one right here, which actually looks very promising. Um, but also, I canceled for now Goddess Provisions because I felt like the last few boxes didn't quite resonate with me. So I am really excited to open this one right here. Here. As you can see, the box is you know, pretty simple. It does have their little sticker right here that says Wolf in Time. And we also have a little stamp right here. I pre cut the box, but let's go ahead and actually open it. So basically, I just kind of cut the tape on the sides, but as you can see, it's still sealed. So I'm going to go ahead and open this. Let's see. I think this one will be easier. Okay, so is this upside down? I hope not. <laughs> All right, let's open this box. I am so excited, you guys. All right, ta-da! Again, the theme is with the wild embrace. I believe that's the theme. <laughs> um, I can already smell either incense or something in here. It's pretty cool. It smells kind of earthy. So let's go ahead and get this first. I'm assuming this is going to be their cheat sheet. And it looks like we have an oracle card here. Um, it looks like I got the sun. So that is pretty cool. Alrighty. So um, I believe this is their um, cheat sheet. Um, yes, and it does say the wild embrace. So we're gonna read this at the end Something that I really like is that this appears to be like recycled paper It does have that look and texture which is a uh, really good, right? So we are recycling. So let's see what we have here. So right off the bat it appears we have um, some sort of paper product um, This feels really delicate um, it does have a stamp that kind of looks like a like a book right here Okay, so let me see what this is. I am assuming it's going to be. Yep. It's like artwork Oh, this is very nice. Oh, it is very delicate. It's like a like a watercolor Oh, this is beautiful. We have like like a falcon here That is very pretty and we have more Let's see Oh, it looks like a like a shaman maybe, um, and it has like uh, he has like horns and then there's like feathers and um, or like antlers. <laughs> and there's like a wolf right here. This is very, very pretty. Like a really nice image. And then here we have. Oh, this is great. It kind of looks like almost like a man um, in like a cloak or something. And then um, it's almost like he is um, like channeling maybe his spirit animal because you can kind of see the outline of like maybe like a wolf, uh, a buck, um, like, like a like a yeah, like a deer, <laughs> um, perhaps like a bear. And there's like paw prints. Uh, this is like really really pretty you guys very nice so we're going to put this to the side these are really pretty like watercolors and of course we have a box full of goodies so let's see what this is um it appears to be a necklace um this is really interesting it kind of looks like an arrowhead um shaped crystal kind of looks like it could be sunstone um just because of the colors um and it has like a piece of like um like fur here um this is really interesting you guys so i can't wait 
to read more about this very very interesting okay so let's continue with our box um okay so this feels um big i wonder what this is um oh you know what this looks like some sort of salt um yeah i'm not going to open it but yeah it looks like we have salt let's see what else we have here um so this came in like a really nice like a uh, cloth type of bag again it has that like uh buck there like a deer Alrighty. so i wonder what this is okay so we have an incense cone Hmm, and we have a crystal. It kind of looks like a blue lace agate, but at the same time, I feel like it's a little too translucent to be a blue lace agate. And maybe, I mean, maybe it is, but it kind of looks like a blue lace agate. It's really pretty, like calming. And there's this little um, scroll inside the bag. It says the wilds embrace bath ritual. Okay, so then we have the crystal. We have the tree of life cone incense, salt, <laughs> and then matches. It says put your water crystal on the side of you in the bathtub. Light your cone incense with a match and pour your salt into the bath water as you say the following. I embrace my true self as the wilds embrace me. I speak my true light as the water sets me free. I connect to the ocean, the forest, and the trees. I embrace my true self as the wilds embrace me. Then let the salt melt into the water and become the sea. Let the herbs soak and give you nature's embrace all around your body. Let the smoke smudge your mind, your soul, and your past thoughts of any doubt, worry, or judgment of yourself, your inner child. You are reborn into the wilds of the forest again, into the ocean swirl, into the beginning when magic was new and raw. Meditate on your experience. Then when you're done with your bath, put your crystal under your pillow for dream messages. That is really interesting. I think I'm gonna try this. All right, so let's see what else we're gonna grab from here. Um, let's take this out. This actually looks um, pretty interesting. I feel like I've seen this before. It says, play a beat you can repeat. Huh, it says, love spin drum red. Huh, very cool. <laughs> All right, so we're definitely gonna read about this in the cheat sheet, but it actually looks uh, really cool. All right, let's get back to our box. Um, so it looks like we have some herbs here. I am not sure what they are. They kind of smell like, I don't even know. I see petals in here. Oh, and there's a piece of charcoal here, like a charcoal disc. Oh, I don't have any charcoal disc yet. So I'm assuming this is gonna be um, just like an incense blend. Ooh. all right so that's pretty cool and oh this looks like it's gonna be a big crystal <gasps> i don't know what this is some sort of jasper this is heavy and it's pretty big All right, so what else do we have in here? So we have a stick here, and it says the wild embrace. Um, this is pretty cool. This stick still has some bark on it, so I'm really curious to see what this is, and just to read more about it on the cheat sheet. So it looks like we still have a few more things in here, or, or a couple more things in here. Alrighty, so it looks like we have a piece 
of Palo Santo. And uh, what is this? Okay, so I'm not too sure. Uh, we have like an empty bag and like a piece of fur. And it looks like we have some beads and a little charm. I'm assuming we are going to craft something. And it looks like we have, huh, let's see what this is. It kind of looks like, like a bow for like a bow and arrow. It kind of has that shape. We have like a feather here. And then we have this piece of metal with some beads. So I'm really curious to read about this and see what it is. Oh, we have one more thing. Okay, so it appears we have another crystal and um, I don't know what this is. It kind of looks like it could be pink tourmaline and it has like some sort of like rune or sigil in here. So let me show you. Alrighty guys, so that was all the items that were in the box. Just to let you know, the Wolf and Time subscription box retails for $54 plus shipping. So for me, living here in New Jersey, it was $66 total with shipping. But it looks like they have a lot of cool things. Uh, so now let's go through the cheat sheet. Alright, so it says the wild's embrace setting free our authentic self through the embrace of the wild the forest the ocean the spirits that protect our earth and through the magic of trance we will travel in the footsteps of the shaman by the heartbeat of the land and the way of ancient craft ancient craft <laughs> all right so the first thing we have is the talisman rune stone so i am assuming it's going to be this one right here it says one of a kind this is the first in this exclusive set the talisman rune stone is a divination tool and a symbol that has both meaning and magic in it from a sacred and ancient source it is hand engraved and hand stained from quartz stone and comes in various sizes and shapes to represent the wilds of nature the symbol represents the sun rising and shining light upon the land with the three realms, the upper, middle, and underworlds, as well as the morning, middle, and later sun faces. It was shown to me in meditation on the summer solstice by a medicine man in the redwood forest to help me protect my land and protect my family. It is powerful, old, and sacred to my ancestors, and now I share it with you. It is carved upon a redwood stump in front of the gate to my family's ranch on stone in front of my home. And now it is part of your exclusive set of divination tools from a shaman. Each box will now come with another piece, also just as powerful. When the set is complete, you will get a casting bag, a casting rug, and a complete guidebook. All pieces will be available later on in the shop but only after the boxes go out each month and the whole set would only be available much later as a limited time offer so that is really cool so again this piece is the first in a series of divination tools so that is pretty cool now i am kind of regretting that i'm only getting july and august so depending on how the august box goes I might keep on getting the wolf and time box, but that's pretty cool. And next we have the shaman hand drum, three different styles. So it is this one right here. You will either have a music, love, or peace style hand drum. And I believe this one was the love one. Yeah, so we got the love one. These have been handmade by a crafter from Peru. The heartbeat of the earth comes in the way of vibration and the best way to go into its trance is the path of the shaman journey of the drum. To play, you simply spin it in both hands like you're rubbing them together to get warm. 
flat and fast. Or you can make slow, long strokes to create a slow beat. You can also use anything as a drumstick and beat the drum. Connect with your new tool, which is easy to travel into nature with, to connect to the forest, the ocean, the land, chant, hum, sing, as you drum and connect to the meditation of the wild. So that is really cool. All right, so I might need to read more about this, um, like on my own, just to get a little more information as to how exactly it works. All right, the next item we have listed is the Wild's Embrace Bath Ritual Kit which we read about earlier and i'm kind of curious to see what kind of crystal we got so it looks like just like with the hand drum you could get a variety of items um so everybody would get something different so for your crystal on the back ritual kit it was either um, caribbean called seed or blue lace agate it looks like i got the blue lace agate next we have the wild bow of truth so this is the last item that we opened which is this one right here and it says that you can use this to either adorn your altar hung by your bed or sacred space each wild bow of truth has been handmade with care and is completely unique they have genuine crystal and stone beads, metal wire to conduct energy, bamboo reed to absorb essential oils for aromatherapy, soft wool yarn, and ethically sourced feathers. As you aim true on your path, remember to use your instincts, your observation skills to touch the bow and breathe, be patient, and become one with the bow. Your truth is yours to guide as your own with the whispers of your ancestors and spirit. So this is really cool. Um, I did notice it has some beads. I have to really look at them and kind of see what kind of crystals or gems we have here. So that is really cool, you guys. And next, we have Fancy Jasper Arrowhead Necklace. Okay, so I believe that was like the first or one of the first things that we opened. So it is not a sunstone like I thought. This is actually, again, this is Fancy Jasper Arrowhead. It says the arrowhead points the way and connects you to your bow and the legacy of your purpose. The wild embrace you so that you not only remember who you are, but also so that you hear their cry for help. Your energy is powerful and can be pushed into the air to give it life. Your arrowhead is made of fancy jasper and comes in many colors, and each one was hand-wired in either silver, gold, copper, bronze, or antique rose gold. Fancy Jasper activates all chakras and it helps you with healing and grounding for overall peace, a steady mind, and a complete soul. This is actually really cool. It looks like mine was wired with a gold wire or gold color wire. I'll definitely be showing you guys close-ups of everything at the end of the video. And next we have the Ocean Jasper Palm Stone. Okay, so I knew this was some kind of Jasper, but I wasn't sure what it was. So it is an Ocean Jasper Palm Stone. I must say, it has a really nice weight to it. It's a really nice size and the coloring is really, really nice. So it says that Ocean Jasper has become more rare and it's from Madagascar with a variety of colors and designs. It activates the throat, heart, and solar plexus chakras. It is both the earth and water elements and brings you the ancient cellular energy of the ocean and the rooted beginnings of the land. It will help you in meditation to tap into your authentic voice you need for your chants, your music, your hum, your communication with the forest and in opening up with confidence to embrace the wilds with a compassionate heart and an open mind. It gives you courage, self-love, forgiveness, and freedom to be yourself. Next, we have your DIY Wild Embrace Rattle Kit. Um. Okay, so it must be this right here. This handcrafted kit was made so that you could create your own shaman rattle to go with your drum to use in meditation in fire dancing enchanting or to connect 
to your ancestors during the full moon. Each cotton bag has been hand stamped with a forest animal and the leather string are remnants that would have been tossed away. So now we are using them to honor the animal and not waste their sacrifice. The beads are wood, crystal, and stone. And there is a feather charm to call to the upper world for messages. Place the Palo Santo stick inside the bag along with the beads and charm, leaving enough out for a handle. Tie the leather and tighten the bag to make the pouch. Then tie the acrylic fur on to channel loving animal spirit energy. Shake, shake, shake. You now have a sacred rattle. Let me see if I can put this together real quick. All right, guys, I did it. This was your DIY rattle. So basically in the little baggie, you put the beads and the charm, and then the Palo Santo stick was to use to uh, hold on to the rattle. And then the leather cord was uh, going around this just to kind of uh, keep the bag and the stick in place. This is the piece of acrylic fur just to adorn the rattle. So that is really cool. I'll show you again a close-up of everything at the end. So that way you can have a better view of what kind of animal they stamped on my bag, on my little rattle kit. Next, we have the Wild Embrace Fire Incense Bag, which is this one right here that comes with a little charcoal bit. Yes. Burning an offering in your cauldron, incense burner or plate. So it looks like this one caught up raw patchouli branches and leaves, mistletoe root, rosebuds and thyme it also includes a charcoal disc light the disc and wait for it to go gray slash orange before you add any herbs or resin to burn on top of next, it next we have the watercolor print which is what we saw at the beginning of the video and next we have the mystical shaman oracle card this is the card that we saw at the beginning i got this done i'm gonna have to research that deck so i know what that means but typically the sun is a good sign right and um just to let you guys know the theme for the August box will be the Gaelic Sea, Gaelic folklore, ancient sea crafting, Celtic or Celtic magic, and tales of the Selkie. So that should be a pretty interesting box. Um, I didn't read anything there about this stick. It just is the wild embrace, but that's a nice touch to add to the body, right. guys. Let's go over favorites and least favorites. I would say my favorite items were probably this really big piece of Ocean Jasper. I didn't have Ocean Jasper and this is a really nice piece. It's really heavy. Um, it has really nice coloring. It's a nice size. So I really do like this Ocean Jasper palm stone. So I really like that. Um, I thought that making this little rattle was so cute. The fact that the box is kind of interactive where it has you kind of make something that you can use. So I really enjoyed putting that together. Um, what else? Um, I do like the little uh, fancy Jasper arrowhead necklace. I really am looking forward to reading more about the fancy Jasper. Um, I think the bow is like really cool too. I feel like it would make like a really nice piece of decoration too. Um, I think this is really awesome and I want to look into how to use it and things like that. As far as least favorite, I can't really think of a least favorite item. I think that making this into just kind of like divination pieces that you're going to get box after box to make a whole set is actually a great idea. Um, okay, and then the ritual here with the bath salt. I mean, I liked all of it a lot. It's kind of hard to pick a favorite, but if I have to go with a favorite, um, it would probably just be my Ocean Jasper. That'd probably be my favorite, favorite, most favorite item in this box. Wow, I sounded like I am five. <laughs> um, as far as the least favorite item, I can't think of a least favorite item because all the items were really special in their own way so i honestly don't have a least favorite item let me know in the comments down below what you thought about the july 2022 box by wolf and time let me know if you have a favorite item and as usual if you love the things that i talk about definitely subscribe comment like and hit that notification bell so that you can keep winking out with me bye